Okay, I hope I got this camera set up so this can record, but pretty much got this circuit board built for the Mustang. And uh, got the chip on it, got all the header pins I was talking about on there. Two 12 pins and six pin for the programmer. So uh, this is the uh, this is the LCD, you know, and I it's got a ribbon cable solder to it with a header pin. So that's just gonna plug in like that. Remember how I said these pl plugs are like on a train RTU? Yeah, same thing. Soldered all those terminals in there. Let me set this up here. Some good light on here. Let's check out the circuit board. There it is. Got my reverse and relay, anti-theft relay for the output. Voltage regulator MOSFET, you know, the chip is in here now, the header pins are all in there. This one normally won't have anything plugged into it, it's just when my uh, programmer, USB programmer, will just be plugged in like so. I don't think it'll work without the power being on the board, but I did try to set it up to back feed. My mouse, where are you? Let's see here. Oops, don't want to do that. Let's just read it. No, it's reading fine. So it's reading it. It's powering off the board. So that's all done. So, real simple. But I could also program it while it's powered up, just in the middle of it running. This is the way I set it up EPP, data clock, ECC, and ground. I just have everything labeled. So looking pretty good. Like I said, the LCD. Let's see here. LCD's got the ribbon cable solder to it. That'll be mounted in that dash pod. So this part can be mounted in the dash pod anytime now, and uh, it can be loose or whatever. And then when I'm ready to plug it into the board, this is hard one-handed. But on the tripod, it was in the dark. Bam. Plug that in, plug this end into the wiring harness in the car, and then it'll be like this. Let's see if we can do it. There we go, I labeled all that too. This is just my test cable. So, using a the battery there. There we go. So basically I have it to set up to where I have my two buttons and a switch, like the switch for the plate activator just hooked up. The plate status, I don't have an in switch hooked up, I just gotta hit here. Okay. So basically, when the ignition's off, it's just blinks the security. Ignition's on, it's gonna say the anti theft is on. You know, and if you uh, try to drive the car and throw this one sensor, it's gonna go in a and I theft mode and it stays there pretty much until turn the key off and then I'm gonna hit a certain sequence. Puts it back the way it was. Turn it back on. And that's what it'll take if I accidentally forget to deactivate it and I start driving, it's gonna shut the engine off and turn the key off. Do the sequence, reset it. So once you do the sequence to after the key is on, hit the sequence, it's going to go to normal mode, and that's how it is until you turn the key off again. Um, and now, during the drive mode, you know, that's when I can, it's watching the switch, and I can say, hey man, I want to, there's a freaking Orwellian device up ahead, I don't want it to see my license plate. So it'll be like, flip the switch, and so I can hit the status. You know. And then, uh, I'm just going to go ahead and put the status back together when I flip it up, that way it's instant. But basically, when you, it's saying it's down, and then when I, uh, want to flip it back up, bam, it says it's now up, it goes back to that mode. Now again, if I flip it, it's going to keep trying to go down until it sees the status. And if I go up, so it's going to spaz. It's going to keep cycling the servo until that plate shows that it's up. Then it's still down, alright, it's up, now it's going back to normal. And anytime it does it while you're driving, it's going to go to that subroutine to bring it back up. Pretty simple. It'll need uh, refinements once it's installed into the car, but the, for the testing, you know, I got all the wires in the right spot. 
uh, and I got to, uh, fixed a little problems in my program. I had a couple things in the wrong spot, but everything's working. And uh, you don't do that. And it's like I said, you know, just there it is, you know.